Why are you wearing your fleece like that? Excuse me. Because I'm lazy. It's giving me arm support, so I don't have to support the weight of my massive arms. <laughs> Free workout for today, day quill. <laughs> and a multivitamin drink. What's up guys? Derek, moreplatesmoredates.com. Today we're gonna be talking about how ruthlessly sick I am right now. I don't have COVID and I'm not actually that ruthlessly sick. Someone took a sickness and then they condensified all symptoms into my two nostrils. The rest of me feels pretty okay. My eyes hurt a little bit. I'm so congested that it's insane. Like the rest of me feels okay, but I just can't breathe. The only reason I'm even going to the gym right now is because we got a group of some friends and their boys getting married. So they're called bachelors, right? That's the right, that's the right word, There's right? one back, yeah. Or is the bachelor the guy getting married? I think the bachelor is the guy getting married. Okay. I don't know, There's I could be wrong. a group of wrong. guys, their friends getting married, and they said for the bachelor party they wanted to lift with me and Sush. And they fucking flew from like a million miles away, so obviously I'm not gonna let them down. And I'm gonna be filming the workout, but I, I'm probably gonna struggle with like 225 on bench. Yeah! Honestly. Free workout for today, gonna be some Gorilla Mode Junkie Juice. And as you guys know, I usually just take nitric plus stim because I'm all about function. I don't really care that much about flavor, but this is actually really good. And I am kind of sick of the flavor, of like same old nitric, same old energy. So we got about one and a half scoops of jungle juice. Should be in stock right now. You can use code jam or code han. No, Code Jam, this is your video. Yeah, but Hannah needs a new phone. I'm sick of her using that cracked <laughs> iPhone 8. Also, Modcast just hit 40K like yesterday, and it's already at 40.3. So we've gained 40.4. So we gained 400 subs in a day. So thank you guys for actually subscribing. We've been saying it at the beginning in all of our podcasts to try to get people to sub, and apparently it's working. And Anna Bars restocked yesterday, and you guys fucking killed it. I hope you guys enjoy. I think there's still, right now, there's still PB&J in stock, but it might be out of stock by the time this video's up. But there will be another restock in like a yeah, week from flavor. now. The new flavor is going to be with that restock. I think so. Well, it's coming like by, the, by next month. Yeah, the so fruity. within like the next two weeks, the Fruity Pebbles will be in stock. I think that's my those favorite. Are really, those are really good. And there's a new, new flavor, which is s'mores, which we haven't even tried mm. yet, but it sounds really good. I took a little bit of Adderall, which I don't... Don't really do for pre-workout that much, but today I really needed it because I'm sick and shit. So I had to wake up. Look at this guys. So I still have a few old Vical stringers left over. Unfortunately only smalls and then this extra large, but we are coming bearing gifts. Giving them a tub of jungle juice. Well, I mean, what more could you want for your wedding, right? Mm, three, new and improved. Three of the new and improved shakers, which actually come with like the little rattly thing, which is nice and a bunch of Vicel stringers. Got the pump cover going too. What, you know what oversize this is? Cause this is one of my favorites. I actually block. I really like this one. Block. This is the block oversize. And the reason I like it is cause I got a girthy ass neck and this is the only fucking t-shirt that I own that doesn't squeeze my neck when I wear it. That shit sounds good. I know it's idle right now, bro. Our neighbors are gonna love us. <laughs> A brand new unopened new flavor of jungle juice. Damn. Okay. Okay. Me and Sush are for the people. I know. Like, Bro, realest guys in the industry. Ah. I was telling Sush the other day when I got him the Apple Watch, I felt way better giving him something that I'll never use, and I would feel getting it for myself. You know. <laughs> Much 
as soon as I unracked that weight. That's why I was holding it for so long. Damn, it stinks. <laughs> it fucking smells. <laughs> I'm doing this set like this. Seeing like a notification from like Mawcast, Seuss, like anybody, like, bro, I'm like, again a few days ago felt okay but like it hurt my chest it hurt my elbows slow script just feels much more natural to me so i'm sticking with it for the foreseeable future oh my god holy fuck holy shit holy shit yeah there's some smoke on the bar but what yeah, the fuck <laughs> baby this just joined the call oh is that caleb yeah i mean you're pressuring me it's a it's a maxing out right now Either max out or like hit like 305 so that next week you can do 310 or something. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. What? Oh! Oh! Yeah! Oh! 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 Bro, so fast. Took big stinky on it. Was that the? That's probably the fastest I moved it. Oh, up, up, fast, fast, fast. Whoa. Use the speed of the bar to make it tighter. I don't know how to. I can't. I can't put it into weight. 320 will be a grinder. Yeah. I'm gonna go for it. All right, let's see it, baby. Let's go. Easy. Come on. Come on. You know what this means, guys. 420. I knew first back it was going up. As soon as he bounced off his chat, I knew. I can't fucking believe it, guys. I come in, I'll get nine hours of sleep, I'll have all the stimulus in the world, I'll feel fucking great, I'll be bulking, and I feel weak on bench. And then I literally feel like dog shit. Don't eat for like two days because I feel like shit. Get like six hours of sleep. I had socky bombs last night, which I never do. And then I hit a bench PR today. Can I try 240 real quick? Yeah. yeah. Bro, he's been stuck at like 235 for the longest time. Went through like I started working out because of David Blaine, but like it was like more James, bro. Like honestly, so it's like it's just crazy. Like actually, like fucking training with him.
This is the only thing that sucks about getting a Tesla. As you can see, May 2nd is when this shit expired. This is only in Texas, I believe, does the supply, which kind of sucks. But every other car that you get, if it's a Mercedes or a Range or anything like that, you pay taxes and shit up front when you buy the car. But with this car, with Teslas in Texas, there's this weird fucking process you have to go through. You don't pay taxes up front, but because of that, you got to pay them afterwards and then they send you your license plates in the mail but you, you have to send them shit then you have to wire them a fucking shit ton of money and then they send you your plates back it's fucking annoying elon what are you doing man first you're tweeting some bullshit about bitcoin and now you're making me get an expired license plate because i don't have fucking time to print out a fedex label and go to fedex and ship it to some random person but anyway we're headed to pick up hannah she got her nails done no some girl shit. So I feel like this is every single video. I give you guys a Vical update, but I feel like I have to because I know a lot of you are, are waiting on it. So everything is ready. The only thing that me and Oliver are still sorting is the distribution. Because obviously, you know, we're not going to be packaging this shit all of our all ourselves. So we're sorting out distribution. The fucking the shipping company I've been reaching out to for days. They finally responded to me. They said all of my emails were going to their spam folder. Maybe they were, but we had a call yesterday. Everything is basically ready to go. Um, all we have to do is send the money over, but like there's a whole onboarding process for the shipping company because at first they thought that we were just going to have like a little small drop, you know, because we said that we were influencers and then we were like, no, listen, bud, there's going to be 7,400 pieces that we're going to be ordering. This is going to be a big fucking drop. So he was like, oh shit, and had to like upgrade me and get me in contact with one of his higher ups. It's it's more of like an onboarding process since it's a big ass drop. Um, but it will pay off, guys. You don't you don't want me to get the lower tier option and then I can only drop, you know, 400 pieces of clothes and then it sells out in 15 seconds. That would just suck. We're going balls deep on this drop. We want it to stay in stock for a while. Hopefully it does. You know, we're not gonna come this far just to let a little shipping issue getting our way so thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next one hi what's up let's see him just let's see him. okay this is a good hand okay okay that's good i like it this is a fake one because it broke Yo, look I really like those. look how pudgy it looks